What is that? Oh, armadillo. Nah, eh, too bad it ain't gonna focus. Anyway, we weren't gonna make a, a video tonight. We were just um, out on the lake getting a uh, spot ready to metal detect tomorrow. We was gonna use the, uh, the mailbox. But y'all gotta see this. This is catastrophic failure of the mailbox. So let me get back here where we can see this thing. If I can zoom out. Sorry, it's dark. I don't think this is going to work too well, but you can see this. I think we bumped the bottom and caused a little separation of the seam in this duct. And man, when that thing separated, that engine collapsed that back ring. So this thing is totally foobar. So we didn't get to clean off our uh, the swim beach that we wanted to hunt, which was on an island that's abandoned now. But uh, we decided to do some magnet fishing. So I'm gonna take this out to the end of the dock because that ended up being pretty fun. We're finding some stuff. Now we, we bought our fishing magnet to take it to a spot where there was some Civil War muskets in a river. But we decided, you know, what the heck, we'll throw it around this fishing pier at the lake where we launch our boat. I know it's dark out here, but maybe y'all can see that. So Jess is over here throwing that thing again. <laughs> we'll have to do a little wrap up because we actually found some goofy stuff. Damn. What is that? I don't know. Oh. I don't know. Got another hook. Yeah. So even though we was going to use this for something serious like Civil War relics, this just throwing this out and catching junk turned out to be way funner than I expected. Oh man, I walked off and look what Jess just got. Let me see if I can get this to focus without. Man, that's a recent drop. That's a, it's that's a nice while. knife. I mean, that's going to clean up. You're going to be able to use that. Uh, but oh, spring, spring. Dang. No, dude, that's nice. There's nothing wrong with that knife. Look at all the stuff on Uh-oh, it's stuck again. <laughs> well, there you go. Look that's the cool, junk. man. There's a ton of stuff on the end of that. But this. Must be where this dock is rotting on the bottom, the skirt coming loose. That is nasty. Jess was ready to go a few minutes ago. He found that knife night. <laughs> He's gone crazy magnet fishing. What is all this stuff? Look, look at the BBs on there. Well, somebody's been down here shooting a BB gun for sure. It's a bunch of them. What is that? What? Uh, the eye off of a end of a rod. Oh, it sure is. Put this in our box. Cash. Look at all that stuff. We found so much junk we had to scrape up a box to put it in. Well, like I said earlier, we didn't plan on making a video tonight. We just basically went to prep a site so that we could make a video tomorrow to do some water hunting, but it just that that turned out real bad. So now that we're in some light, we're back at the house, you can get a good look at the uh, what's left of the mailbox. So when one, one piece goes, it just, it goes, all of it. I mean, it even bent the uh, angle iron frame. This was really only built to do one project, but we've been using it, and it's held up pretty good. I mean, you know, it only cost, I think that elbow was like 18 bucks. Everything else is scrap. And it works like a champ, but uh, it's, it's this one's history. So I'll have to take that one off. At least I got the frame. I can straighten the frame and just add another elbow. So to salvage the night, we did some magnet fishing. We got a couple of these long things. We got a piece of pipe and a rebar. But, you know, we, we bought the magnets for another project. 
I had no intentions of just throwing this thing around a local lake, but I'm telling you, it, it was fun. We had fun throwing that, and let's look at some of the stuff we got in just a couple of hours of throwing it around the pier. So we got tons of hooks and fishing tackle. Got the little bell they clip on the end of the rod. Got some weights off of a cast net or a seine. Bunch of wire. Got a spoon. Uh, there are batteries, uh, bungee cord. Uh, we got some tools and a lot of hardware, probably from where they built the uh, the floating fishing pier. Uh, razor blade, drill bit, welding rods, nails, uh, washers, nuts, bolts. Uh, I think probably most of these lag bolts come out of the running boards off of boat trailers. And this is a bunch of just nasty tin and metal. And I don't know if that's a bent piece of rod or if it's a, some kind of rusty U-boat, cotter pin. Lots of bottle caps. We took a lot of bottle caps out of the lake. Screws. Um, got a CO2 cartridge, a lighter, and then the end of a lighter. I thought I had find of the night with this, uh, man, this is a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle fishing pole. I bet it'd clean up and I could use that. And then Jess turns around and he gets this really nice knife. This one's going to clean up and it'll still work. I bet it was probably dropped on Memorial Day weekend. It couldn't have been in there that long. And then I, I got these two knives. They're, they're foobar. They're not going to work now. I don't think they'll ever clean up. Um, this one's stainless, but whatever's in this mechanism that makes it work in this handle, I guarantee you that's ruined. So that's, uh, that's what we found magnet fishing, and that was the first time that I'd actually seriously got out there with that magnet and threw it around um it was just a lot funner than i thought i may have to do some more of that but we are going to use the magnet on a, a civil war site that's why i actually bought it and hopefully that'll be successful we know a spot where there's supposed to be a bunch of muskets in a river so we're going to check that out but until then we'll see you in the next video